all in line? What the fuck? No, what the actual fuck? What the actual goddamn fuck? What the actual goddamn motherfucking goddamn fuck? slamming congratulatory brunch for when you get home to celebrate your first day on the job. It's gonna be dope. Oh, and it's official. I'm gonna be spinning at that idols party I told you about, so hope you can come. TTYL. Hey there, it's Nina. So excited about your new gig. I thought you'd want to know, I, I heard back from the museum. Uh, they, they went with someone else for the junior art curator job, so... Looks like I'm still stuck with Los Pan... Anyway... Glad one of us had a good day at least. See you soon. Hey, it's Eli. Congrats on your first day as part of the workforce. Speaking of which, um, when you asked to borrow my copy of Be Your Own Boss, I assumed it was because you wanted to read it, not to level out the coffee table. So let's talk about that when you get back. Can't wait to hear about all the HR forms I'm sure you had to sign. Everything smells amazing, Kev. You know what would make it smell even better? Hey, man, if you want a $300 waffle maker, you can buy it with the exposure the idols pay you in. Don't expect us to chip in. I've told you before, the idols are trying to build a post-capitalist society where money is not a concept. Yeah? Then why don't you go run off and join the commune? I'm into showering. Are you gonna help me get the waffle maker or not? As an investor, I don't like wasting money. You're wearing a fucking bow tie. <sighs> okay, I will throw in 20 bucks for a waffle maker. Nina? Um, good for 10? Who helped you move your forged paintings last month? Fine, 15. W what sort of waffle maker can I get for 35 bucks? Uh, presumably one that makes fucking waffles. Hey! <laughs> hey, the wave slave is back! How was your first day? Were the other mercenaries nice to you? You know, as far as hired killers go, I'd give them a seven. You look like you could use a mugmosa. Thanks, Eli. Seriously, how's the job? Eh, it's the murder business. The fundamentals don't change, just the uniform. I can tell you love it. Okay. I don't have to love it. I have to pay my student loans. Poof. <laughs> I'm in. So I'm guessing that means the pay's good. Uh, supposed to be. Got stiffed on my bonus today. Dude, what the fuck? I uh, played a little fast and loose on the job, and, uh, well, my CEO wasn't a fan. You gotta be kidding me. Swear to God, this lady walked right off the set of an 80s action movie. I was half expecting her to call me Rook and threaten to take my badge. Are we gonna make rent? We'll make rent. We just gotta be a little more creative. Last time we got creative, I got stabbed three times. Hey, it would have been four times if Nina and I hadn't shown up. It would have been zero times if you were on time. This is true. Look, this is really not a big deal. We just knock off a payday loan place. No one gives a shit if people rob those bastards. You have a job now. You could actually just take the loan. Eli, I don't do business with morally bankrupt companies. You work for Marshall. Brunch is a time for friends and mimosas, not debates on morality. All right, all right. Man, this is really fucking good, Kev. Thanks. I was worried I added too much pepper. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No, seriously, this is perfect. The only way this could be better is if you put on a fucking shirt. Dinner and a show, baby. Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, brunch is done, dishes are clean. Let's go rob a payday loan place. And you know how we should celebrate afterwards. Karaoke! Yes! So, Nina, are we taking your project car? 
Fuck no, I'm not risking my baby over rent. We're boosting cars from down the street. Ooh, can we take a hybrid? Eli, I love that you're worried about fuel efficiency, but I'm thinking acceleration is gonna matter more. Your carbon footprint always matters. Let's take that yellow one. Kev, you case the place. What are we looking at? One guard out front and the owner at the till. He's a real scuzzbag. I want some kick a dog. So, you know, fuck that guy. Almost there. But only you psyched. can decide how you oh, react no. to adversity. Oh no, this crap again. Only you can hey. choose to adapt the to rules. the changes. Don't yuck that someone's yum. Life. You have more agency and power than the world wants you to know. But to realize that power, there's something you need to do. You need to be your own boss of your job, of your happiness, of your life. You don't. Be your own boss. That's right. Be your own boss. One of these days, I'm going to get you to listen to music in the car. Roger McGillicuddy speaks the music of my soul. You are a different kind of cat, Eli. What can I say? The world is full of uninteresting people, and I'm not going to be one of them. You got one of those for me? You really want one after last time? I am not the first person to accidentally shoot a friend by dropping a loaded... Yeah, okay, I don't need a gun. Good call. Showtime. So I made them watch while I broke their dad's... Ah, oh, shit. Walk away, or the phrase dead-end job gets literal. <gasps> I, I don't have much... We don't want your money, just his. Get out of here. You done fucked up. I've been getting that a lot lately. Where's the safe? If you're lucky, the cops will get to you before my people go. <laughs> nice left. Been practicing. I can tell. Safe's back here. This guy had his password be a bunch of fives. Pick it up, Eli. I'm just saying, he could have at least made his work for it. Same plan as last time. Eli, Kev, pretend traffic laws matter and get the money home. Nina and I will split up and give the cops the runaround. Cool, let me get the McGillic. No! Try to keep up this time. Yeah, yeah. See you at the switch. Time to beat it before the cops show up. Life is full of adversity and challenges. But Oh, fuck no. I'm monitoring the police scanner. They're just responding to the call. Cops are now en route to the Payne place. Sounds like they're out in force. Shit. Guys, I got cops on my ass. Nina, don't wait for me. I gotta lose these guys. Try sideswiping them. It always works for me. Just let them get alongside you, and then bam, send them into a app. Bad time for a train. Not going fast enough to do any damage. You need speed for a good side swipe. Nice speed up. Try to hit their whole side, not just the bumper. You'll do more damage the faster you go. Another one down. Ha! That took care of them. How's everyone else? Eli, you ready for karaoke? Start warming up those voices. Nina, where you at? Just changed cars and headed home. Good. Headed to my switch car now. 
It was safe and sound at the junkyard a minute ago. That's pretty deep in Pantero's territory. Did you tell your gang you did that? Are you kidding me? If Sergio knew we were running a job on his turf, he would have taken a 90% cut. 90%? Good God. The man's either a monster or a capitalist. Genius. What? What the fuck did you assholes do to my getaway car? Ain't your car if it's on our turf. Now you're gonna pay for parking. We're taking you down! Oh! I needed that fucking car! Cover! <laughs> we'll teach you to respect Los Panteros! We have time for this shit today! <laughs> The things I do to pay my rent. You can't fight back oh, against us. Oh, you're gonna die now! You said you could do Without Sergio, say so. Who cares? Ah! Problem. Los Pantero scrapped my switch car. They what? Bigger problem. The police picked up that firefight at the junkyard. They're heading your way. Grab a bike and head off road. I'll pick you up in the desert. Damn. Sounds like no karaoke tonight. Every fucking time, man. I'm on my way. There's a trail that goes between the mesas. I'll meet you on the other side. Got it. Do I want to know what happened to the Panteros who stripped your car? Sorry, Nina. Self-defense. Fuck, I didn't want that to happen. Let's hope Sergio never finds out it was us. You free and clear yet? Not at all. I've got cops up the ass. I'll pick you up on the other side of the bridge. Oh! You called for a ride? You said you didn't want to risk your car. I said I didn't want to risk it for rent. I'd risk anything for you, dummies. So, is this how it's gonna be every time we have to pay rent? I thought that went great. Yeah, okay. Maybe I can go back to running my old side hustles for extra cash? Don't worry. We'll figure it out. This town is full of opportunities, if you know where to look.
Hey, glad you made it home safe. We have to get better at this rent thing or we'll never get to do karaoke again. Also, we'll get evicted. Nina said you might go back to some of your old side hustles. I have some friends who might need work done in your area of expertise. When you say friends, do you mean friends, friends, or special friends? All my friends are special. I'll put their info on your map. I think you'll really like them. I'll like them fine as long as their money's good. Thanks, Kev. <laughs> <laughs>